This is Daisy, and I'm Ray. Welcome to a walk with us on the southeast portion of a trail that goes around Buffenville Lake in Charlton, Massachusetts. We just finished kayaking, and those are my kayaking shoes. But Daisy has convinced me that we must go for a walk now. And how can I say no to that pretty face? I have a leash with me. Dogs are required to be on leash at Buffenville. And the truth is, if I see somebody coming, I'll put a leash on her. But she really wants and needs to run. So I let her run. I don't run much myself, so... Now, I'm very confident when I call my dog, she will come to me. But there's no harm in her exploring. Here, Daisy found a shortcut. I'm across this bog. The trail goes around the bog back, loops back. She made that look so easy. And it kind of seems to me the tree gets narrower down on her end. Isn't she beautiful? What a wonderful girl. I'll let you know I made it across without the incident. Several other bogs along the walk and the trail have little bridges put on them. They're very nice. Some of them, I think I trust the tree more than I did that, that bridge. And again, here's Daisy waiting for me to catch up. And she's on a bridge. It looks like the tree fell on the bridge. Uh, I should be questioning the integrity of this bridge, but once I stepped on it, I realized it's, it's still holding up. And again, I hadn't anticipated a long walk. Um, look at that muddy puppy. Is she having a great time or what? This is the west south side. It starts going the trail starts going north along the other side of Buffenville Lake. I decided maybe this is the end. We'll we'll start heading back. We'd come a long way. You see, there are trail markers on the trees. Yeah. I wish I felt like doing that. Just run down the bridge and jump over the branches. Not so much. Muddy border collie prints. And here she is. This is where I'm glad I have my kayaking shoes. I can just hose them off if I have to get them wet or muddy. Hiking boots and sneakers take a little more work to get this kind of mud out of them. Look how happy she is to have me in the mud with her. I thought I was off trail until I saw the next bridge. And look how happy. She's walking her favorite human. Border Collies must have a job. And I'm sure she thinks this is her job. She's getting it done.
I'm not off trail. That is a, a man-made bridge. Those two logs, they're wired together. So I think maybe uh, the storm washed out some of the trail. That's how Daisy chose to take that. Uh, I'm going to see if I can stay on top of these logs. You see, she waits for me at the end of every obstacle. Make sure I clear it. She runs ahead so that she can get a splash. Before I catch up. There she is. here mostly is too shallow or too many obstacles for me to bring my kayak in and enjoy these rivers. The trail is mostly level, not a whole lot of hills to it but it is very close to the water sometimes and kind of steep on the edges. So just be careful of your footing. There's Daisy waiting for me there. Isn't she beautiful? She doesn't want to lose me any more than I want to lose her. We're always together. It seems to me it's a little steep and a little muddy in that spot there. our shortcut again. As you see, it doesn't slow up Daisy one little bit. And to her, that's the main trail. Now, I'm going to assure you, I don't do it as well as Daisy does. but I can do it. I was a gymnast in my younger days, so I should be able to walk across a balance beam. It gets narrower as you get this way, I guess. trail boss saying, nice work, you made it. It's a wonderful day and a beautiful trail to walk on with your dogs. Well, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I hope this inspires you to take your dog out with you on your adventures, walking, hiking, biking, and have a nice time together.